Bacteria and viruses are all around us. They are a part of our everyday lives, but some can make you sick. Remember the last time you had a fever or a nasty cough? The reason you were sick was probably because you were infected with a virus or bacteria. It really doesn't feel good to be sick. Luckily, there are many ways you can protect yourself and others from getting infected. For example, you can wash your hands frequently, cough and sneeze in your elbow, and cook and wash your food properly. There are also other weapons that protect you by training the immune system to fight off infectious diseases. These are called vaccines. Vaccines are carefully developed in labs. Most contain a harmless version or part of the virus or bacteria. As scientists learn more, new technologies and vaccines are continuously being developed to fight even more diseases. Usually vaccines are given through a very thin needle in your arm. This can hurt a little bit for a couple of seconds, but most people hardly even feel it. Afterwards, your skin where the vaccine was injected may become a bit red, itchy, and swollen. Once the vaccine enters your body, your immune system is activated and starts preparing to fight back, just like it would against a real virus or bacteria. While your immune system is busy being trained, you may feel a bit tired or even get a low fever. This is a good sign. This means that you are building an army of antibodies and veteran B-cells. Should you come across the same virus or bacteria in the future, these cells will recognize and remember the enemies and immediately fight them before they make you sick. Our immune system's ability to remember the invading virus and bacteria is the strongest defense we have to fight infectious diseases. We use vaccines to prepare and train our immune system for an attack, so we can protect ourselves and others.